So today we're going to talk about why patch cords have an A and a B. That's because you've got a transmit and a receive that are on separate lines. So your upload goes on the transmit line and your downloads go on the receive line. That's why you have two lines for your fiber optic. So you have your lens, your receiver, and there, which has a pin diode for the receiver and a laser diode for the transmitter. So inside there's some very clever optics. Here's a typical example of one of those lenses looks like inside. They're um, pretty minute, very accurate, and uh, highly sophisticated things. This is what the end of a typical fiber optic cable looks like. Uh, as an example, currently it's got red light shining through it. So next we're going to talk about what the layout looks like in the next slide. So, over long lengths you need what's called an optical repeater. So there's a bit of attenuation of the signal over the length of the fiber optic cable. And then you have what's called a repeater. So it receives the signal in and then transmits it again. Now the difference in speed between fiber and copper is that copper can do 10 gigabits per second where fiber optic can be 200,000 gigabits per second and that has to do with the frequency not the speed electrically copper and fiber optic travel at the same speeds however the magic source lies in the frequency that can be achieved by fiber optic so here's a couple of interesting things. The electrons move very slowly through the copper. So the signal is actually a magnetic wave. And that's what travels at the speed of light. Fiber optics are immune to EMI. It's more secure. You, tapping into fiber optic is difficult and detectable. While with copper, it can be tapped and leak signals easily. The glass in fiber optic is purer than a diamond. So... There's no noticeable loss. It's very, very transparent. The other reason for the high speeds is wavelength division multiplexing. So they actually use different light wavelengths as well. So there's multiplexing happening. But at home, copper is still the best. Right, and that's it. Thanks, ladies and gentlemen. Have an awesome day. Bye.